welcome back to my channel Alex here if you've never seen these big old cheeks before then do consider subscribing before you leave so for today's video I have my Alex adores for the month of March I meshed March and I think February together because I like I told you guys last year was using up all of my stash but I do have some new goodies to share with you guys so everything that I talk about today as always will be listed and linked down in the description box so let's get started with my Alex adores for the month of March okay so there's a lot going on on my table but I think I want to start with my hair stuff first because I've been doing a lot with my own natural hair here lately so the first thing I want to share with you guys is one of my well two of these are basically my favorite brands the first one up is by cream of nature this is from their coconut milk line I think their coconut milk line and their argan oil line are my two favorite lines from cream of nature but this is their moisture curl hair milk and y'all if you're having a dry hair day or your hair is just doing the most, you know how natural hair is. It does whatever it wants. So on my days where my hair is unruly or it looks dry or just isn't cooperating, I reached for this and my curls were like, yes, God, please. So <laughs> this does a really good job of defining and elongating my curls. Um, it smells amazing. Their coconut milk line is just decadent like this smells like a food fruit smoothie on your hair with a touch of coconut it's not that overbearing coconut i know sometimes um coconut scents can be really strong and overpowering this is not it like this smells really really good it has no faith no sulfates no mineral oil nothing like that and the pump actually locks so it's great for travel you guys know i'm always all over the place so that's always perfect so i've been obsessed with this the next one for my curls and this is telling on me because I use it so much that my hair is all over it. I'm sorry, that's probably kind of gross for some of you. But yeah, that, that proves I use it a lot. So my hair is my hair is covered in this thing. Okay, so this is the Miel Organics. It's another favorite brand of mine. Their line is bomb, y'all. They have a Babusu, I think I'm saying it right. I butcher names all the time to think that I, you know, was a journalism major. You'd think I know how to pronounce things, right? But <laughs> this, their Babusu uh, deep conditioner is amazing. My curls love that stuff. But this here is their pomegranate and honey curl smoothie. They have a pomegranate and honey line, and it smells gorgeous. Like this thing right here, my curls love this stuff especially if i want to do something with definition it really defines my curls and once it dries it's nice and soft and bouncy it's not crunchy or anything like that um this curl smoothie is basically a styling product for your thick hair and it's i can't even say it's amazing enough oh my goodness it's so so good now the only thing with this one is my pump um, it might have been me that my pump screws like it's not working anymore so I literally have to knock it out and I think I'm almost out of this stuff so yeah do go ahead and give this one a try I think you can find them um, in Sally's just like you can find cream of nature in Sally's if not like I said everything I talk about today as always will be listed and linked in the description box for you the final thing for my hair is surprisingly some hairspray this is by da -da -da -da, I believe the brand is called fresh scent and this is their All Weather Aquanet Professional Hairspray Extra Super Hold. I have been using this on my own hair. I've used this for my wigs and weaves, and this stuff is a perfection. It does a really good job um, if you use like to use hairspray with your lace fronts. It does a good job of holding them down in terms of sweat lifting them up or anything like that. Holds your flyaways in place without them moving. You know, I have issues with humidity. So once I do my hair, my buns and stuff, and spray this on it, smooth it over, I don't have any issues with humidity at all in terms of my hair starting to swell up and frizz. So if you're looking for a new hairspray for the summer months, the hotter months, and it starts to get humid and stuff like that, then I would give this one a try. It looks like this. So you can go to the store and find it, or you can just buy it online. It's fine. So on to my skin here. Um, let's talk about the shower. <laughs> I have been obsessed with Aveeno for a long time. Um, my brothers have eczema and I have patches every now and then, so I guess I have a touch of it or whatever. But their Aveeno Active Naturals line, this one is their Stress Relief Body Wash. This is empty. This is my second bottle for, I think, I used this up in less than a month. 
I take a lot of showers. Yes, that's me. But yeah, I use this up in less than a month. That stress relief one it smells of lavender. It smells amazing. It's not a in shower experience either. You know, how some body washes when you just shower with it, you just smell in the shower and that's it. Like this one actually, it's on your skin, but it's not overpowering if that makes sense. So the lavender scent stays with you to calm you, you know, and put you to sleep. So I use this night and day, but it smells really, really good. It has um, laxing, relaxing <laughs> lavender and lang lang and chamomile and things like that. So it calms and relaxes and moisturizes the skin so yeah do check out the Aveeno active naturals line their body wash line is amazing I think they have lotions in the Aveeno active naturals as well um, in terms of their skincare and stuff so do check that out and also for a face wash I have emptied this bottle y'all I probably have to turn it upside down to get the teeny tiny little bit that's in here left this is by pharmacy this is their clean the ultra gentle facial cleanser and I got this in one of my past boxy charms I'll also have that link below if you haven't signed up for boxy charm not sure what you're waiting for uh yeah so this one right here this is a very very gentle cleanser I've never used anything so gentle yet effective in forever like this stuff I think this is the tiny ball I think they have a bigger ball than this but it does a really good job of getting rid of excess makeup and oils and impurities off of the skin leaving your skin feeling really clean but not stripped so that's how my skin felt with this even though I have an acne prone skin it didn't break me out or anything like that it's that gentle you guys so do give pharmacy a try I'll probably go ahead and look into the rest of their skincare line really excited about that and for oh I'm dropping stuff guys for my moisturizer you guys know I switch up a lot and this one from Clinique this is the Clinique ID you guys this this right here this is amazing this is their they have a duo system now let me figure, let me pull this up because it's really it's a lot going on with this and I have to explain it properly basically you can create your own custom hydrator okay so they have a different ones you basically pick your base which is the clinique um dramatically different moisturizing lotion and then after that or you can get the gel or you can get the hydrating jelly there's a lot going on there and after that you go ahead and pick your concentrated um section or the concentrated hydrator that you're going to put inside of this so there's another concentrated step inside of this that you put in yourself the cartridges you can choose from with the clinique id system you can get for irritation you can get for pores not even texture uneven skin tone fatigue lines and wrinkles things like that and i believe i chose uneven skin tone and i've been using this for the past it's been what two months that i've been using this and i love the texture of it what it happens is when i put it on my skin or when i pump it out it pumps out the moisturizer with the actual concentrate so those come together they don't come together inside of the bottle they come together when you pump it out so i just rub that together in my hands and put it all over my face it dries down quickly i don't feel greasy at all but i do feel moisturized if that makes sense so it really absorbs into the skin very very quickly and in terms of seeing a difference of how my skin looks I see a little bit of a difference so far normally you can't really tell um, with skincare within I would say about three or four months um, to see anything happening with your skincare but so far I love the formulation I love the mixing of the two and it feels really good on my skin I know my skin is moisturized my face is moisturized once I use that product and so far it's been really really great and you definitely get a big bang for your buck like this is huge so it'll probably take me a minute to get through it I'm about here on the bottle so I've got a long time to use with that now as far as makeup goes I have been enjoying a couple of things so first up has to be this gel liner by pretty vulgar their products or their product line has been growing on me a little bit so this is their the ink gel eyeliner and it's a very black gel liner I am mirroring it right now wearing it right now on my eyes it's very very creamy and smooth and black like when you put this on it's super duper black now i like to use this formula with a thin liner brush it's more like a like a pencil instead of the the arch or the curved or the angled liner brush i prefer to use that type of brush with this because i feel like it goes on a whole lot smoother so and it's a huge container like inside i'm i'm probably never ever going to finish this but there's a whole lot of gel liner in there and I think the packaging is adorable and it's really weighted so it's very good quality and the product inside is decent as well. Next up for concealer, obsessed with this one. This is by L'Oreal. This is their infallible full wear concealer. Wearing it today, it's... I wouldn't say it's thick but it's full coverage I can say that it's full coverage it moves around very very easily and it stays in place doesn't crease doesn't move anything like that 
on me. The wand is huge, so you get to cover a very large surface area really quickly, so it allows you to work really quickly, and it works very well with other products. Like That's what I found out about this one. It works very well with my foundations and different things like that. And as far as lips go, I have been obsessed with the combination that I'm wearing right now. It's cork lip liner with this lip stick right here. It's a lip lip stick from Makeup Forever. You guys know that's one of my favorite brands. This is, I want to get the correct name for you. This is their Artist Liquid Matte Lipstick, and this is in the shade number 203. So it gives you that nice pinky like it's the same color as the top i'm wearing right now it's a beautiful springtime pink and i just mix it with the cork mac lip pencil and i'm good to go like any um brown lip liner would work with it because as it dries or before it dries you can really blend it out and it dries down matte it's beautiful the finish of it is beautiful and it's very very comfortable to wear it doesn't really move or budge when you eat or things like that so that particular line from makeup forever their artist liquid mattes you need some of those yeah, you guys, that's it for my Alex Adores. Do let me know down in the comment section what you thought about today's video. If you use any of the products that I talked about today, do let me know down in the comment section what you think about them, which one's your favorite, and what are you going to go out and store and grab. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching and subscribing if you have, and I'll see you in my next video really, really soon. Bye, loves.